is going everyone? This is Ricky and today's video you guys another survival games episode. We are playing on Demon's Breeze on the MCSG server. And this guy, Minecraft Brett, I think he just said, um, I Recky, I love <laughs> I love you, hairy toes. <laughs> so I ran into a fan, that's pretty cool. Um, so if you're watching this video, hello. And uh yes, that is my uh second character, I guess, hairy toes. <laughs> Even though if I get caught on the MCSG team speak, I probably will get banned from it, but um yeah, guys, I am uh, going solo in today's episode, and there's a certain reason why, um, because, uh, there's this big thing that kind of happened, um, with my life, and I kind of want to share it with you guys, and I think it'd be kind of an interesting thing to talk about, and I just, feel, I, you know, I just really want to just sit back, play some MCSG, and, you know, just tell you guys about it. Um, so, uh, it's sort of a long story, but I'll try my best to explain it, um, but anyways, guys, uh, let's get started here, so, um, just the past, um, few days, or... No, well, I should, so I live in, like, the Midwestern states, and in the Midwestern states, like, it's, I don't know if you guys heard on the news in the U.S. that, um, it's, it's pretty chilly over here, and, you know, there's wind chills everywhere, um, it's getting cold negatives and stuff, and, uh, you know, it's just, it's really, really cold, it's, it's really, it's really bad, but, um, so, on the day of the really cold days, like, out of all the cold days, it had to be Okay, he's dead. Um, out of all the days that were extremely cold, our furnace happens to break. Why is my sound super loud? Um, so our furnace happens to break. You know, the furnace is the thing that uh, um, heats up your whole entire house, and that you know you really need that during the winter, especially during these harsh um, weathers. So our furnace breaks, and you know we have to call the furnace guy. And s sadly, he didn't like have the part in order to fix. Um, you know, the part in the furnace, so we were sleeping in a very cold night, but the thing is, the furnace guy gave us, like, this heater thing, so, I mean, it kept us, some of us warm, but, you know, it was still extremely cold, so I woke up, and I'm, like, just absolutely freezing and stuff, um, so the guy has to go, like, two hours away from, like, uh, where I live, and he had to go pick up the, the part that he was missing in order to fix, um, you know, the furnace, so he got back and you know he started working on it and then my dad was sort of like with him you know he was just kind of I guess helping not exactly helping but I guess keeping him company I don't know how to exactly say it but you know the furnace guys there working on it and um you know I'm just chilling in my room talking to you know my sisters and my sister and my mom and stuff and why is my why do I have something loading in the world why, I don't, my mouse is being weird um but yeah so I'm just chilling out in my room and the next thing you know I hear a big poof and this was a big like boom and it like shook the whole house and then my ears popped as well and stuff and i thought it was the wind i'm like um did you guys feel that as well and they're like yeah i'm like did you guys ears pop i'm like yes and then like i i thought it was the wind that like shook because the whole house shook and you know i have a big house and it, like it shook the whole house and i'm like it was that the wind or like i thought that they fixed the furnace and i just thought it kicked into gear and i thought it was working so I'm like, oh, it must be working. And then then I hear my little brother, who's like two, two years younger than me, he starts yelling, fire, fire, fire. I'm like, wait, what, what, what? And then, like, everyone panicked. And then, like, because the only people that were in the basement were, like, my dad and the furnace guy, which were working on the furnace. And my brother was there, but he was, like, in the computer room downstairs. But he ran by, and he saw a fire when they were working. They were working on it because the fire, like, blew straight from the furnace right at, like, the furnace guy's face, which... I feel really sorry for him right now because he's probably in a bunch of pain. Um. Uh, but yeah, it. Uh, so it, there was like a fire that like bursted from the furnace, and cause like there was like a gas leak apparently, and the guy didn't like check everything. He like kind of just like started. Whoa, the sound chopped off there. That was kind of weird. Wait. Okay, I thought it was lagging. Um. Can I grab this? Nope. Uh. Or can I glitch it? Wait. No, I can't. Um, so yeah, uh, it was, so, okay, I lost my spot. Why am I so bad at doing this stuff? Um, so, you know, yeah, my brother's running upstairs from the basement, and we're all up on the top floor, and then he's just like, there's a fire downstairs, the fire, and then, like, I hear the fire alarm in our house go off, and like, oh, gosh, so then we, like, run out, like, most of us run out, and, um, you know, we get into the car, and we drive off to our cousins, which is only barely a mile away from here, and, um, all the people, the only people who were left in the house was just my dad and the guy, and we didn't we didn't know if they were okay or not, because they were, in, like, in the basement, and the fire, like, blew, like, straight at them, and this was a big, pretty big fire, and, um, so, you know, my mom calls 911, and she's panicking really bad, well, we were all panicking and stuff, so, 
it's pretty crazy. Um, so yeah, they called nine one one. We're at our cousin's house. We're, we're trying. We're calling the uh, firemen that were there. Well, cause like my aunt, my aunt's um, husband, which aka my uncle, is a fireman. So he wasn't there, but he knew what was going on. Um, so he was just he was he was telling us that it was all okay. Um, everyone's. I mean, uh, my dad had a few blisters on his hand. Um, the the furnace guy has a few blisters on his face. So I mean, he's he's probably he's probably in pain right now. I mean that kind of kind of hurt, but um, it's all okay and stuff. Um, luckily, uh, if the fire like went this, if the fire went this other direction, so it didn't like catch anything bad on fire. But if it went this like sort of the other way at the wall, it probably would have caught the house on fire, and the house probably would not be here right now, and I probably wouldn't be here right now. So it was a very very scary moment. I'm still kind of shocked. The the house, um, still kind of smells like smoke from it. Um, cause like when I came back, the house was all smoking stuff, but the fire guys were here taking care of it and stuff. And, um, it was just really crazy, really, really crazy. And, you know, it could have been, it honestly could have been a lot worse. It could have been worse. Oh, I have 200 ingots. What am I doing? I'm like running around here. Let's go to the spawn. But yeah, it could have been a lot worse. And if I was super nervous, I was like the house, my dad is still in there. I don't know if he's okay. Or not? I mean, I was like, what is happening? I don't know what to do. So, um, you know, the outcome, it was uh, good. I mean, some the carpet in the basement is uh, all burnt and stuff. Um, what else? Oh, I had my, like, because I was getting my blankets, like, my blanket washed from my bed. And, um, you know, that was, my dryer is, like, right by the furnace. So, um, that got caught, that got kind of caught on fire. So, um, I don't have my blanket for a couple days. So, <laughs> that's, um kind of um a bummer i guess but um yeah so uh, the carpet's kind of like caught on, like it has some like it's kind of burnt my blanket's kind of burnt um some of the walls kind of burnt but yeah it's we, it should hopefully be fixed here soon i think we ha we have to actually replace the carpet and stuff so it was a pretty pretty scary moment that could have been a lot worse um this guy's going to come after me um, can I knock you in? I don't know if I should attack him because he has the high ground and, you know, usually whoever has the high ground wins. Oh, look, see, this is what happens. I don't want to get risk knocked into the lava. I'm not going to risk that. I want to fight on flat ground, dude. Fight me on flat ground like a man. Um, so, yeah, it was just, um, very, very scary, scary, scary moment. And, uh, I couldn't explain. I thought, like, and plus, I was also, like, really bummed out because, like, um, my channel lately has been really, really good. Oh, come on. And, and oh, this is kind of selfish to think about, but... Oh, my gosh. That guy, like, shot me way back here. Oh, my gosh. That is such a dumb move. But, um, I guess I'll let that happen. Um, But, yeah, so... It's, oh, my gosh. I'm still kind of shocked from it. I mean, everything's okay. I mean, oh, I thought I was going to lose all my... Like, when we were driving away from the house and stuff... And, like, to my aunt, I thought that I was in the last time I would ever see the house. I thought, like, all my, like, a laptop and all my equipment was going to be gone. And just, like, you know, oh, my gosh. I was just thinking a lot of things, and I thought it was going to be the end for everything. And I thought I was going to blow up in my house for a second because it was, it was a pretty big fire. And, you know, fire guys took control of it and got all the smoke out and stuff. So it's all good now. We're just uh, some other personal reasons that we're taking care of right now at the moment. But yeah, guys, I guess I'll end it here. I know it was kind of a bad episode, but I just really wanted to share this um, situation with you guys, um, or moment, whatever you guys want to call it. But anyways, guys, be sure to leave a like and a comment. Um, I can't explain how much I've been happy with you guys. This the support lately has been so awesome. I I just I can't explain how much I I, I love it right now. I I really hope you guys stay with me like this and. It just really means a lot. Sorry if I'm bad with my commentary. I'm just I'm a little a little shook up and stuff. But um, yeah, guys, be sure to leave a like and a comment. Um, and as always, guys, stay awesome and um, expect more in the future. And uh, peace. Wait, peace. peace.